Hey guys, Trevor here, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to save a video from your Google Drive over to your iPhone. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now, if you have a Google Drive and you have a video on there that you want to bring into your iPhone and share it, send it as text, upload it to Instagram, whatever, I'll walk you through those steps. The first thing that you'll want to do is head into your app store here and you'll want to just search for Google Drive. So we'll want to use the Google Drive app to be able to download that video onto your iPhone. If you already have it, of course, you can just skip this step. But once you see Google Drive here, just tap the download button and go through and, and install the Google Drive and log into your Google Drive. Now, once I already have that, you can see I have Google Drive right here. I will just open up my Google Drive and then we can navigate to a video and save it to our iPhone. So let's just go into one of these random folders. I'm just going to go to one of our how to apps videos and say this is the video that I want to download onto my iPhone. I can tap the three dots at the bottom right here. And then it gives you a bunch of different options. We want to choose the options toward the bottom that says send a copy. So once you tap send a copy, you'll see various options and you'll see save video. Now, if you don't see save video at the very bottom, you can see edit actions. We'll tap that. Potentially that wasn't added to your list of options. You'll want to, if it's down at the bottom with a green plus, you can hit that but we'll tap save video and it'll say preparing to export the video. Now it might give you an option that you need to allow access to your photos from Google Drive. Just say yes, because they want to download and save it to your photos app. So once it goes through that process, it'll just remove, it'll just disappear with that screen and we can head into our photos app. Now a tricky thing here is that it won't necessarily list it on the most recent, um, it won't list it at the very bottom as the most recent video, it'll list it as the video whenever it was created chronologically. So you'll have to scroll through potentially to find that video, but here you can see this is the video that we just downloaded from our Google Drive over to our iPhone. So now it's in our photos, we can tap the little share icon at the bottom left, and we can save it to files, we can send it as a text message, email, we can upload it to Instagram or TikTok or whatever we want to use with it. Hope this helps. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below and make sure to subscribe. Thanks.